Well, boys, little video. This one's on a QJE PS30 SWIV. Um, it's got a problem with switch turn putting on or off. Sometimes it wants to turn off. Well, turn off is easy, but turn it back on. She acts right stupid. under load just with a radio attached to it the voltage is at 10.2 like, that's not even normal and neither was that flickering that it just had going on there whatever that was about so we'll turn off the radio voltage goes back up to 12 volts 12 volts is a max that this thing loops it specifies it's supposed to do 13.8 volts in the manual it's not doing that at all. Adjustable. You put 8.2 to 12.1. So. Bizarre. I don't know if any of you guys have a power supply like this or give me some idea of how to actually increase the voltage on this thing because 12 volts is not going to cut it and the fact that she's going to 10 volts just with a radio connected to it and receive I'm just going to turn the radio on and you'll see the voltage drop like that's not normal not normal whatsoever. Doesn't look like this thing has ever been messed with or not. Apparently, this thing has been discontinued since like the late 1990s. So, it's not exactly the uh, newest thing on the market. <laughs> That just nuts. Why it's going down so low? Now that is it. QJE PS30 SWIV. Is this thing supposed to do 30 amps? <sighs> yeah, right. Mirror milliamps. Maybe an amp at this point. If it's even doing that. I can't even run a radio in, in receive. <laughs> I don't imagine what it will do if I put the radio on the transmit. Anyway. This one was donated to me there a couple days ago. If I want. I just figured I'd take her out night and see what in the, see what it's doing or not doing. Anyways. Got any ideas? What the voltage would be so low on this uh, QJE uh, PS30 SWIV? Let me hear you in the comment section below. I'm interested to see what the uh, what it could be. It's a switch mode power supply, and uh, they all have their little quirks by no means. So, anyway, let me hear your thoughts on this uh, power supply.